Good morning, everyone. I am currently getting ready for the day. Today is Thursday. I'm finally getting my hair done, guys. Like, wow. It is, um, it needs it, okay? I'm in the process of, like, going blonde, and it was going to take quite a process. My sister does my hair, and my sister got in an accident. So, obviously, it, like, pushed back me getting my hair done for a bit. And so, now, we're back. She's getting her hair done. Exciting. Or I'm getting my hair done. Whatever. I need to go wet this every day of my life. So annoying. Okay, so um, I'm getting my hair done today, which is very exciting. My sister's salon, if you guys are in Dallas, she does hair, so go to her. She's actually really good too, especially if you're blonde. My appointment's at 10, it's currently like 8.30. I have to drop fits off at the groomer at nine, and then I need to drop off my bedding at the dry cleaner because it just needs it, and I, I don't know. Parachute home, you can't, ooh. Okay, so it took me legit four minutes to do my makeup, so that's good. I don't know if that's like something I should be proud of. Lip cheat. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is my favorite lip liner and I've been forgetting about it. Comment down below. Weekly vlogs or daily vlogs? Really just Pillow Cheat by Charlotte Tilbury. This and their lipstick, which I also have. The poor guy thinks he's going to La La Land. He has no idea. He's never been to the groomers. This is his first time. Fit. you're gonna have the time of your life. You're gonna come out and you're gonna be so handsome. You can't even see him. <laughs> Aww. He actually, when I gave him a bath, when I gave him a bath, he's actually really, really good. Like, crazy good. Like, he's such a good dog. My whole family talks about this. I got very lucky, Fitz. I got very lucky. Coco got groomed like a week ago last week. Yeah, and then um, he had to get like a certain thing before he can get groomed. But now he has it and he's ready. Fitz. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So I just dropped Fitz off at the groomers. Um, I can't believe he's so big. He's just perfect. I can't believe it. Like, and it's not just me saying this. It's everyone around him. So anyways, um, I'm going to the dry cleaner now. This is really like a, this is quite the Red Wedding Housewife vlog. But I'm going to the dry cleaners because I have a parachute home bedding and I tried to wash it. I washed it myself multiple times and I feel like I'm just ruining it. So I'm just gonna take it to the dry cleaners. Guys, I just dropped off my comforter and it's gonna take a full week. Is that normal? Um, can I have a grande ice skinny vanilla latte? Okay, thank you. I, I drove so out of my way of where I'm going to go to a drive through Starbucks and I sat in line and waited in the longest line ever. And so now I'm actually not gonna be that early to my appointment, but that was like the level of lazy. Also, I was thinking during COVID, like we have an excuse to do this because it's like you don't wanna go, obviously like things are open and all of that, but if you can avoid going inside somewhere, like just avoid it, you know? We're getting your drinks on a drink carrier Thank you. All right guys, I know it's so dark. I'm sorry, I don't know what's up. Anyways, my sister does hair in Dallas, which I've talked about before. Um, up until a few months ago, she actually did it in the suburbs of Dallas, in Frisco. But she moved to her favorite and my favorite salon, the salon that she was out in Frisco, guys. Like, I just, like, really did not like the people who, like, owned it. Like, they were just not nice. I personally loved going to get my hair done for my sister. I just didn't like going to that salon. So I'm thrilled because now she's in Dallas, and so she's so much closer to me. Alright guys, I'm blonde. Obviously this is a process, so I'll show you guys in the car. Um, but my hair feels so much better. It is 3 p.m. Such a process. I have to go back next week. It is really going to be something. But, um, yeah, I go to Global Group Hairdresser. Hairdressing? I don't even, yeah. No, hair, hairdressing. Um, in Dallas. And then also, I go to Carlos. But my hair feels so freaking good. This is my hair. Very blonde. 
Um, it feels really good. Anyways, I need to go home. Um, Seth, my little brother, actually made homecoming court. So he wants me to take him to go get a shirt to wear. Isn't that just the cutest thing you've ever heard? So I'm going home, I'm gonna meet him there, do that. I have things I need to do tonight, I keep putting it off. Sav is last minute in town, so she's gonna come over tonight. And yeah, that's the plan. So I'm heading back. Guys, I am so blonde. Oh my gosh. Guys, I am so blonde. All right, I stopped at Velvet Taco for lunch. My picnic, chicken, taco, elote, and then I just got lemonade. I'm home. I'm so tired. I'm gonna make a coffee, guys. I think I'm just having a caffeine crash. My twins flame, my twin flames package said it arrived today and then I got home and it wasn't here. So I'm hoping it just got delivered to like the wrong neighbor and it'll be sent back and like delivered to me or something. Sometimes I have problems in my neighborhood with packages. So we will see. But guys, I am so tired and I still have so much to do. Hey guys, I'm on the rooftop. I'm listening to some music. I'm about to do some reading. I made coffee because I'm just so tired. But I have my normal stuff that I do so every day. Um, well, I try every day. Honestly, it's not been the best. I go through phases where I'm like really good about it and then where I just kind of get off. But um, I do like my Devo. So I'll do my Bible reading for the day. Sometimes I'll read from a Devo and that or whatever that might be. And then I always journal. Journaling really helps me um especially like it just helps me so much and then i also have this notebook which i haven't even used yet but a lot of you guys have purchased because i shared it in a video it's the anti-anxiety notebook and i just wanted to share it because i think it's really helpful um if you guys struggle with anxiety especially if maybe you haven't been able to find a good therapist or a therapy just isn't really an option for you right now for whatever reason um it's really helpful so it's like what happened what is going through your mind what emotions are you feeling what patterns do you recognize? How can you think about the situation differently? And then just like a continue another like reflection page basically. But it's cognitive behavioral therapy, um, which is what a lot of therapists use. This is actually made from therapists. So they're made by therapists. So anyways, um, I plan to use this when I'm just home and I just need to feel like I need to do it. But normally whenever I will actually go through and journal and stuff, I feel better. Lots of noises outside right now. I'm just so freaking tired right now. Like, I don't know what's up. I'm gonna do my reading. Um, oh my gosh. Hi guys, welcome back to the living room. I feel like I have lip gloss all over, but I don't, so, you know, whatever. Anyways, today's video is going to be our last week in James. So if you guys wanna go back, we have four other videos. We all right, guys, I just recorded a little Bible study for Monday. I normally do this. Um, I don't know, I'll do it between Thursday to Sunday for Monday on The Living Room, which is my faith-based Patreon. For $7.99 a month, you guys can get faith-based podcast episodes, guided prayers, um, Bible studies, uh, videos on certain topics, whatever. It's it's cool, I promise. Check it out. Anyways, we just read out of James 5. I did a lot of reading. I might actually keep doing more reading. Drinking my coffee. Here we are. self-tan but a lot of you guys actually asked on Instagram story which I forgot to do so I'm doing it here for a review on the Lux unfiltered face drops so as you guys probably know this is my favorite self tanner I will have it linked down below and I will tell you right now why it is the best um by the way I want to shower so that's why I, I did this because I don't want to you know I was looking at my hair I can't believe how blonde it is it's like so blonde and no, this is not the end of the process. I went on Instagram Live and a lot of people are asking. Um, we're going blonder. It's just like obviously can't do it all at once. But this is the Lux Unfiltered Hydrating Self-Tanning Cream. There are a few reasons why I swear by this self-tanner. Number one, I, I don't even know. This is not from, I, I don't even know. I can just go on from forever. Um, it doesn't streak. You literally apply it with your hands. It, nothing. Like literally it's not streaky at all. It's really hydrating. It doesn't smell. It doesn't stain your white clothes, which is probably like my biggest thing. It's gradual, so you can build it up yourself. Um, it goes, it's not gradual to the point where you don't get color the first time though. Like you do get color, but it's basically just like a really safe lotion to use. It just gives you perfect color. It's next level. This is the best self tanner ever, especially if you're someone who's like a little bit afraid of self tanner. 
this is safer, but you also will get a healthier, more natural looking glow. They finally came out with face drops, which before I would just put that on my face, and they're not supposed to, but it worked for me. Um, I don't wear, especially at that time, I wasn't wearing makeup enough to like not self tan my face because my body would be so much darker than my face and then it would just be like annoying. So anyways, these are the bronzing face drops. I really do like them. Um, I've only used them twice, but I definitely get really good color and I'm a big fan. Honestly though, I've, I haven't even put them in my moisturizer. I've just been straight up putting it on my face because I wasn't thinking, but you could do either or, but I'm gonna put it in a moisturizer tonight and see how I actually like it. So I'm doing that, it's like 7 p.m. I just finished packing, it didn't take me long at all, but that stuff is almost done. Um, I have a lot of computer work that I need to do still, and I'll probably order dinner. I just applied the self tanner. Um, obviously I didn't wash my hair, I'm not supposed to wash it for two days. I applied the self tanner and I don't feel sticky. I could pretty much immediately put clothes on. It doesn't transfer to clothes, like it's just the best self tanner ever. I feel like it looks better in person, but like doesn't everyone say that? Good IV, of course. Kenzie 25 or 25% off. But anyways, I just packed a bunch for the weekend and I'm actually using the sleep one tonight. Because I had a coffee late, I'm already worried that I won't be able to sleep, which is kind of nice because I actually have things to do. But Fitz just like sits on me at all times and then Coca makes a noise and then he tells her to stop. This isn't like my favorite, favorite flavor. I like it, but I like the lime one better. All right guys, so this is the end. My remote blends in, but I have everything packed, I'm ready to go. I just have a lot of computer work to do. I probably have like three or four hours of work to do. And then I'm out. So, you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Um, let me know if you guys like daily or weekly vlogs. Love you guys so much. If you made it to the end, comment down below pink. Um, that's it, I'll see you guys soon.